Alright, YouTube, what's up? It's, uh, I Touch iPods here. And, um, I'm just doing this, uh, video. It's a review on my, um, silicone case for my iPod Touch 1G. Um, it is, uh, the DLO, the Jam Jacket by DLO. Um, the product is 1999. It's available on their website or in, uh, Best Buy. That's where I purchased mine. Um, like I said, 1999. Um, this was the first case I ever had for one of my iPod Touches. Um, this is as soon as I bought my iPod Touch, I bought this case. Um, it is silicone, as you can see. It bends. Um, it's very, it was the very first case I bought for my iPod Touch. Um, it's a great case, guys. It, if they made, like, they do make this case for the 2G, um, but I like my Rebel a little bit better, um, I would get this case for my 1G, I just don't really, um, I just like my Rebel a little bit better, but guys, I recommend this case so much, um, I'm mainly doing this review because I actually did get a couple of PMs asking, um, cause people were seeing my old videos, hey, what's that case you got, um, where'd you get that case, it's pretty cool, I like some of the features on it, so I just decided to do a little review on it. I don't have an unboxing on it because obviously it's a little bit older, um, but they do make new ones. Uh, you can go to DLO.com, get f ones for your iPod Touch 2G, iPhone, iPod Nano, iPod Touch 1G, um, and all that good stuff. So, like I said, this is my favorite case, uh, silicone case. Um, I'm just going to do a quick little review on it. Alright, as you can see, it is silicone. Uh, it does have a little uh, cutout for the home button right there um it does have a little cutout for um the wireless signal not the wi-fi but the signal so it can send out signals um because the ipod touch does have a little signal right there um and that keeps it open which most cases don't have that um so it allows your ipod touch to get the signal better um for wherever it's getting the signal from so um Sorry, just adjusting my camera, because it never gets just right, as you guys probably know from watching my videos. Um, so now, I just want to show you guys this with the iPod touching it. As you guys know, I do still have my iWraps on here. Um, it does fit in here with the iWraps. It just slides right in from the top. Goes around the bottom. Goes on the bottom, flip it up, flip it up, it goes on the sides, and it fits it perfect. Like they say, it's the jam jacket. Um, it's got grips on the side here. Let me see if you guys can see that. It's got grips right here. Yeah, you guys can see that now. It's got little bumps right here, which act as grip when you're holding it. Great grip, feels great in the hand. Oh, that's what she said at 3.30. Um... <laughs> I know you guys are going to do that. It feels great in the hand. Um, yeah, those are those grips. Uh, it has these, um, as you can see, these little indents that kind of stick out um, right here. So when you place your iPod Touch face down, the iPod Touch itself isn't hitting the table or the surface. Um, it is actually getting that much space off the surface. So you're not scratching your screen, so the screen's not touching the surface. Um, so that's giving you a little bit more of protection. Um, when you buy this case, it doesn't come with any screen protector. Um, actually, it does come with screen protector, sorry. It comes with, uh, just the regular screen protector, where you, um, kind of like this one that came with the Rebels, where you just peel off one side and then peel off the other and then just stick it on and then peel off the other side. Um, it does come with a screen protector. Um, let's see, what else can I tell you guys? Alright, now it says DLO right there. Uh, now, the main feature about this case, why I like it so much, is that, alright, here, you got your iPod headphones, you plug them in, they're all, they're all somewhere, they're all wound up, see, mine are all here, what you do, you take this, you wrap it around, move this case out of the way, you wrap it around, you guys are used to that, but here, you can't get to your screen, the, I, the headphones block it, it'll interfere. Um, and it also isn't that great for, like, storage, maybe in your pocket or something like that. It's, it's unlevel, it's, 
It's just it won't be comfortable in your pocket either because it kind of like it bulges it out. So here's what's great about this case. You can take your headphones, you can take this, unplug it. It says to um, stick it up through the hole that is right here, but I can't seem to fit it all the way through there. That's what she said. So here's what you do. This is made exactly for the iPod headphones and mainly any other headphones that can fit in that slot. It fits right in there. And what you do is you take your headphone and you wrap it around this outside part. Just like this. There are little notches along the sides if you want to hook them in there every once in a while. To make sure it stays in there. Um, just keep wrapping around there. Just wraps around. And then once you don't get enough, you can go back. And now, here's what you do. You just take your headphone. Place it in that little indent. It's just deep enough for the headphone. Place it in that little indent. Twist it a little bit till it gets tight. And there you go. Your headphones are safely in there. It's not as offset but as the um, wrapping around. You can access the, your screen now. Um, you can get to everything without anything inter, um, intervening, like the wires. Um, it feels even better now because you get like this little, almost like a finger holder there. That's what I got used to. Put my finger behind there, and it gives it a little bit more support. Um, it does. The grip is really good. Um, like I said, that's the that's my favorite feature about it, the headphone. Uh, you can wrap it around there. Then you just unravel it and plug it in and listen to your music. Um, it also stops your headphones from ripping at, like, the, I know the iPod headphone, like, my first set of iPod headphones I have had, they ripped right here. I don't know if yours guys ripped. These are my new ones, so they're not ripped. But they had ripped right here. Um, like, that little plastic piece had ripped um, because of when I put it in and then bend it up to wrap it around. All those times I would do that, all those times lift it up to bend it around, you eventually just tear it little by little until it tears it all the way. This way, you just unplug it, stick it right in there, and just wraps around, and you don't get that um, bending effect as you would from the other thing. All you do is wrap it under there, and it makes sure it, it actually gives you enough slack so it doesn't give you that bending effect under there. So it actually, it's, it'll prevent your headphones from ripping, if that's ever happened to you. Um, it's shock resistant. What I also like about it is it puts, offsets it a little bit, but it's still level. It, like, keeps it off, off the table, so if you guys, like, like, doing reviews on YouTube or something like that, you can have it up here, so it's a little bit up off your, uh, table or wherever you're doing it. Um, it is $19.99. You can order it at DLO.com, or I know, or I know it's available at Best Buy. Um, just seeing if there's anything else here, guys. It's lint-free. It doesn't collect any lint at all, which is great about it. Um, comes with screen protector. Uh, oh, yeah, and another cool thing about it is that the open bottom. You can um, charge your iPod right, right from here. You don't have to take off the case. Like, and you might have some hard shell cases. You don't have to take off the case just to charge it or listen to your music. It's right here. Um, that's another great feature. The headphone button lines right up. There's a little hole for the headphones right there. Sorry about that. I forgot to mention that. Just turn it on right there. Um, and that's basically this case, guys. It's the DLO Jam Jacket 1999. Um, I recommend it a lot. If you guys have a first gen or second gen and you're looking for a good silicone case, get this one, guys. It's great. Um, probably my favorite silicone case out there. I'm going to have to go because it's coming up in 10 minutes. And I will have more case reviews coming up because I'm getting some in the mail. And also, I'm getting the Invisible Shield in the mail. And maybe even some more for some, from some other people and companies. So, guys, thanks. Favorite, comment, rate, subscribe. Please rate this video. I'll catch you guys in my next review, unboxing, um, or app review, or jailbreak news. Um, see you guys later. Apple update your link in the video description. Be safe, guys.